my name is Ms. Genevieve. I'm the programming coordinator at the Big Piney Library. Uh, we've got another Tuesday afternoon craft for you for grades K through two. Uh, we'll be reading a book and making salt crystal art. Uh, you'll need paper, Elmer's glue, salt, coarse ground if you've got it, watercolors, food coloring, and a few paintbrushes. Um, all right, so our book today is Red, a Crayon Story. Y'all ready? Red, a Crayon Story by Michael Hall. Read with permission from Harper Collins. He was red, but he wasn't very good at it. This must be a fire truck, huh? Oh dear, his mother Olive said. His teacher thought he needed more practice. I'll draw red strawberry and then you draw red strawberry. You can do it, really, said Scarlet. But he couldn't really, like this? Oh my, let's try again. His mother thought he needed to mix with other colors. Why don't you two go out and draw a nice round orange, said Olive. A really big one, said Yellow. A really orange one, said Red. But they just made a big greenish mess. Yuck, said Yellow. Oops, said Red. His parent grandparents thought he wasn't warm enough. Your class is making self-portraits for parents' night. Wear this warm red scarf, said Silver. Nice, it's so you. But it so wasn't. There's Red's self portrait. Oh dear me, said Silver. Everyone seemed to have something to say. Sometimes I wonder if he's really red at all, said Amber. Don't be silly, it says red on his label, said Hazelnut. Cocoa Bean said, he came that way from the factory. Frankly, I don't think he's very bright, said Fuchsia. Well, I think he's lazy, said Grape. Right, he's got to press harder, said Army Green. Really apply himself, said Steel Gray. Sunshine said, give him time, he'll catch on. Of course he will, said Sea Green. But he didn't catch on. Green made a green frog. Black made a black sheep. Brown made a brown cow. And red made a red, uh, 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 ah! All the art supplies wanted to help. The masking tape thought he was broken inside. This will help hold you together. The scissors thought his label was on too tight. One snip should do it. I thought he, he wasn't sharp enough. Stay still now. Do you think any of that's gonna help? But even with all our help and all his hard work, looks like he's still in trouble. He just couldn't get the hang of it. Oh no. One day he met a new friend, Barry. Will you make a blue ocean for my boat? I can't, I'm red. Will you at least try? So he did. Thank you, it's perfect. You're welcome, it was easy. And he didn't stop there. Bluebells and blue jeans and bluebirds and blueberries and a big blue whale. I'm blue. And he was blue and everyone was talking. My son is brilliant, said Olive. Who could have known he was blue, said Amber. I always said that he was blue, said Hazelnut. It was obvious, said Coco Bean. Barry said, his blue ocean really lifted me. All of his work makes me happy, said Seagreen. His blue strawberries are my favorite, said Brown. Apple Green said, he's so intense. I'm going to make a green lizard with him, a really big one, said Yellow. Ah, here, he's working on huge new projects, said Gray. He's really reaching for the sky, said his teacher, Scarlet. And he really was. Man, it's tough trying to be something that you're not, huh? If you could be a color, what color would you be? I think I would be teal, which is a combination of blue and green. Um, all right, now that you've got your color, think about your least favorite color. Think about what it would be like if you had to be that color. It'd be awful, right? It's way better getting to be who you really want to be, huh? All right, so for a craft, um, you get to use all your favorite colors. Um, let's get started with our crystal art. 
All right, I've got all my supplies. I've got my paper. I'm using a cardstock. I've got my Elmer's glue, my watercolors, but you can also use uh, food coloring. Uh, my paintbrush, water, and my sea salt. And I'm gonna try to use coarse. All right, first we're going to make our design with our glue. I'm just going to do a nice, fun, swirly design. You guys can write something, or you can make a picture out of it. I just thought it would be nice to do something that's not too serious. Awesome. Oh, that was messier than I thought. All right, now that we've got our glue coated, we're just gonna take our paintbrush, put in a little bit of water to a color, and when we press it down on the salt, it will start to spread and color the salt. We're done. There's our beautiful salt art. That was so much fun. Thank you for joining me. Um, I really want to see photos of your salt art. Um, you can post them to our Facebook post or you can email them to me. Both links are below. Um, stay safe, wash your hands, and I'll see you next week.